and then i mean we're at the point now i think where we have to do the tough part of ranking them all so yeah what if it's six what's five i mean it probably has to be falcon and winter soldier um only because they had to change so much that um there's like a whole pandemic subplot that yeah they wanted to include that they couldn't or chose not to so i feel like it's got to be that even though i liked a lot of things about that series i did too it's the best action movie of the series. Yeah. If you yeah, take it that definitely. way, like it's my dad watched it in one sitting. It's definitely the, the, the one for people like him. Um, and it was supposed to be the first one that was released. So it was supposed to be like, yeah, here's, you know, punch fest reset. Yeah. And away we go. Yeah. It's a, it's a good, like uh, a weirder and weirder primer between, or like it's a good jump between the movies and like a show being a little yeah. bit slower and taking its time and being weirder for sure. Yeah, I mean, honestly, it's if with that one as the first show as it should have been, that's kind of like the same as using the Captain Carter episode of What If as the first episode. Yeah, of What If because it's like this is going to get crazy, but we're just going to give you a little taste of what you're used to first. It's very true. It's like it's like something you know, but slightly different. Yeah, that makes it last of the live actions just because it's not telling the new story. But I'm, maybe I'll be excited about what's ever going to happen at the ground level. What's your four then? Love Hawkeye, but I feel like now it's four. I think Hawkeye's probably fourth of those. Then what's three? Um, three should probably be so WandaVision here. Yeah, Lo- Loki and Moon Knight are one and two. That's for sure. What's the what's the better one? Loki? I'm trying not to have recency bias. So I'm gonna, no, Loki's better. Loki's yeah. Better. Six, what if? <laughs> five, Hawkeye. Four, Falcon Winter Soldier. Three, WandaVision. Started great and did not great. That was one of the first times a TV show made me feel like it pushed me in the mud and pointed at me and laughed at me. I did really like yeah. the show overall, though, still. Two, Moon Knight, kind of a roller coaster ride. I think it was like one, two, three, four, maybe it was kind of like, yeah, five was like, yeah, and six was like, okay. And yeah. uh, Loki was like just the most consistent that they've done so far. So I think Loki's one. It's closer then probably it should be just because the height of some of the greatest of the moon that episodes like like again i think five mm-hmm. is the best thing that they've done overall for a show episode and Definitely. then one was the best intro episode for one of the series too so it's got that going for it yeah without if you take one and five out i think moon knight's like on the level of like falcon winter soldier or something like that you know what i mean it's nowhere near as good without those two or if those two aren't as good. Yeah, that's that's the rating. And I and I feel pretty good about that. 